the show Cops. Yeah. I actually had cops ride with me. You did? I did have cops ride with me. It's a, it, you'd be interested in how that goes. The way Cops operates is, is that there's, there's, there's a few film crews. There's a sound guy and there's a camera guy. And I think, I, I don't remember how many men, but it was very few, like four or five of these teams. And these guys were so interesting. Um, they essentially go out and by the time they came to our police department, it had really changed uh, because of civil law where you weren't able just to film shit and throw it on TV. You had to get waivers from everyone that was involved. And that involved criminals signing off saying, yeah, you can use that shit, which is fucking so stupid. If you signed off on that shit, you're the dumbest guy on the face of the earth because it's all now evidence that could be used against you in Insane. court. So it was really tough to get those guys to sign off. But believe it or not, you know, we, unfortunately, when it comes to crime, you're not dealing with a lot of scholars. So you would get a lot of signatures. But by then it was a little tougher. So what they would do is, is they would ride with you. They would pick an officer and they, they I, I was fortunate enough to be picked and they would ride with you for two months, every single shift. Yeah, and at that time I was working three twelves, which is three shifts, twelve three twelve hour shifts, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, which was the busiest. That's why at graveyard. So that's why they wanted to ride with me. So you would go out with these guys and it and the man, it was like it was like a it was like performance anxiety. You know what I mean? It's like Oh yeah, I, dude, I felt this twenties. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I just felt this need Ugh. to perform, man, you know, and and and, and it's hor it's harrowing. Police work is some days there's just nothing going on. Oh, you know, yeah. you got to you gotta self-generate, whether it be tickets and hope you can come up with stuff. So I always felt this pressure to go out. But speaking with these guys and their experiences, like the, the sound guy had been shot yeah. in the leg. Um, uh, the other guy, something had happened. <laughs> their stories were awesome because they had been all over. They were telling me stories, dude. I'm just going like, fuck, that is so awesome, dude. I can't even believe you experienced all this shit that you've experienced. I mean, these guys probably walked away from that show and have mental problems themselves. Yeah. Because they, they, they essentially were cops all the time on patrol. Well, imagine you're a sound guy and you're like, oh, it sounds like somebody got shot and then it's fucking you. Whatever, you know, I mean, they had all kinds, these guys had great stories. So essentially they would ride with you the whole time. And the issue became is you felt so much pressure to get material. Oh yeah. Um, that, when they um, rode with me, they rode with two different officers, me and another guy, and I literally didn't make the show. I literally didn't make the show. Action. I didn't. Well, I, and the one time I did, the guy wouldn't sign off, and they couldn't make the cuts to make it relevant. So I, they, I literally didn't make. But I actually became really good friends with these guys because we'd spent so much time and talking that I, I, I was talking to him. I, I don't now, but I was talking to him for quite a bit, calling, going, "Where That's you crazy. at? And what's going on?" And wow. Said, but the way that they do cops is. When when you watch it, it looks like it's 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 progressive. It looks like this is happening. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it never registers with you. And like they go, they're in the car and they get the radio call, and it's like, oh, uh, you know, three seventy two respond to non breather, right. da, 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 yeah. yeah, whatever it is. And you see the cop go, okay. And then all of a sudden he's driving and then it cuts away and you see the car making a right hand turn onto a street and never really registers with go, well, how the fuck did they know he was going there to be on that thing? You know what uh, I mean? I'm a guy that has no idea of the industry and editing all that. So it wasn't until they rode with me and I watched the cops and, I'm, and I went, well, how the fuck are they getting all these angles and shit? So what ends up happening is find out is they would, we would have the situation, they would get out and they would they would be in it. I mean, you would have to literally tell these guys, look at dude, you need to step the fuck back. You know, you need to get behind that car right now. I get it, but I, I, I need you to do that. So they were always up on you and they'd be filming and get everything they can. And then they would go back and go, Hey, look at, I think this is something we can use. So this is what I need you to do. I need you to drop my camera guy off on that corner. And I want you to go back to this street. And then I want you to fake like you're responding to the radio. I'm going to be in it filming you, you know, with the other yeah. camera. So there's acting involved. You know what I mean? And I was a young kid and I just couldn't do it, dude. I'm just not an actor. You know what I mean? So they would like be filming. So all those guys you see doing it, that's all acting up until the actual scenario. Wow. Which never really, never really crossed my mind. No, that's yeah. Like, in my mind, I'm just think, oh, that makes sense. They have footage everywhere and they're just getting all the, you know, that's like, they're just dialed in and getting everything that's, yeah, they would, you don't even think about nah, that. And they would have tell me, okay, now I want you to come and open that door. You know what I mean? And then you go back and watch an episode and go, okay, now this shit makes sense. Why didn't that ever register with me? This is all bullshit. You know what I mean? Except for the actual scenarios themselves. Yeah. You know, they would just film it raw and they would do their editing magic and, and make an episode. But it takes, it takes two months every single night with two different teams for a half hour episode. 
And they said they struggle sometimes to get that. Hope you enjoyed that video. And you can watch another. And you can watch this one. You can watch this one. Different options, different choices. Some guy just brings you one option, not this guy. Two options. Watch one. This one or this one.